I am very excited about our next guest. Well, I'm glad you are because, listen, every triumph and tribulation at the Olympics has a backstory. For gold medal Olympic diver Tom Daly, the backstory involves some yarn and a dog. Following his win in Tokyo, Daly was seen on the sidelines with his eyes not on the pool, but on his knitting needles. What frock exactly was Mr. Daly making? For that, we turn to our next guest, one of our favorite canines in the lower 48, Izzy the Frenchie and her dads, Dr. Rick Hendricks and Shane Jordan. Welcome back. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Okay, so I've read the headlines. I've read page six. I saw TMZ, <laughs> but I am going to the source. How did Izzy become the lucky recipient of this Tom Daly jumper? You know, we were talking to Tom about um, his win and congratulating him and uh, about some of the things he was doing. He was knitting and he was given to charity. You know, he lost his father to cancer and some of the charities are really close to his heart. And he was like, you know, uh, going to make something for Izzy. And we were thinking, okay, this is cool. Maybe after the Olympics, maybe never, maybe in 10 years, you know, he um, <laughs> said he was going to make something. And we had no idea, you know, he was going to go out the next evening and, and on television, you know, across the world, he's going to mm -hmm. sit there knitting this jumper uh, for Miss Thing here. Mrs. And, Thing, uh, Miss Isabel. <laughs> oh my gosh. But hold up, let me walk this back one second. Because you say, I was talking to Tom Daly. I don't have Olympic swimmers in my Rolodex. So how did you get to know this, this Olympi Olympic gold medalist? Uh, just social media. Um, uh, so, so he's not in our Rolodex either, if that, oh. if that helps. Well, maybe yeah, after yeah. this he will be. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Unbelievable. So this, this, this jumper, is, it's creating quite a fervor. As I mentioned, yeah. you were approached by TMZ, and you broke some news to them about where Izzy is going to wear this jumper. So let's just, let's just listen to the clip. We are we we can't find it. C c please tell us where Izzy is going to be wearing this this jumper. So she'll be wearing it to some of the New York Fashion Week shows. Excuse me, can I have yeah. a ticket to front row, please? <laughs> <Out of four. laughs> Absolutely. Unbelievable. So oh, there she is. I love her. So we obviously know she's very fashion forward. How do you describe her style? Exactly. Oh, well, she's like loud, anything loud, extra, over the top is Izzy. She's got to stand out. So. Yeah, as well she should. Now, I yep. know uh, over the past year, I was very concerned. I actually reached out to you guys uh, on Instagram uh, that she was We appreciate it. She, well, you're welcome. She was ill. Uh, tell our viewers what, what, how, why she was ill and how is she doing now? You know, she was uh, at a play date and a larger dog had jumped on her back and uh, she had uh, two areas in her spine that were um, that were dislodged and she had two slip discs and she was in ICU uh, for quite some time and she had some back surgery and during the back surgery, uh, Dr. Haley, who was her surgeon, had uh, called and said, hey, we couldn't finish the surgery because we started losing her um, and they had to move her back to ICU because her heart was stopping and so it's been a it's been touch and go, and we're hoping, crossing our fingers, that uh, they got enough done, yeah. and she doesn't have to go back under any any kind of surgery. Yeah. yeah. Oh my gosh, look at her! She is a vision of yeah. couture. I want to bring in the gang because we've been talking about Izzy all week. Uh, in case you forgot us, it's Dan, Betty, OG, and Ben. Hi, Izzy. Hi. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Hey. Thanks for answering my my messages on social media. I know I keep bothering oh. you. <laughs> No, we love it. Izzy's obsessed with your gardening. With my, excuse me? With your gardening. Oh, with oh. my gardening. At least oh. someone, yeah. someone is. Thank you, Izzy. Yeah. Gnome. Yeah. Right? Someone is. So, okay, so <laughs> does Izzy often get approached by TMZ? She's been on a couple times. Yeah. yeah. Um, so, uh, yeah, a couple times she, when she's in town, they may stop and see her and say, hey, and if, if they think it's cool, they'll talk to her and if they don't they just uh give her a kiss and go off my goodness mm -hmm. the paparazzi. i gotta ask i mean she's so couture what is she wearing today what is this pink little frolic that oh, she has yeah. on i needed that it's actually no, from kidding. london it's a <laughs> <laughs> it's a designer from london called duke and duchess so mm, she's Very fantastic fancy. and the jewels is that from the queen herself <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> my, 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 I, I have to know though, is she, does she ever walk around sans frocks? Mm. Naked? I didn't want to uh, say it. I didn't want to be rude. Yeah. My gosh. Yes. Yeah. yeah, she likes to let it all hang out. <laughs> Don't we all? <laughs> Don't we all? It's a morning. It's a morning yeah. show. That's yeah. right, Izzy. <laughs> Cover yourself up. <laughs> I know the last time we had all of you on, uh, we were talking about her her book, uh, Wear the Damn yeah. Mask. Will Izzy be taking on any new causes this year? You know, we talked to the publisher about doing a new book, and uh, the last book, thank you, by the way, for all your help. It went to number two uh, as a bestseller oh. nationally. Nice. Um, it, uh, it it was fighting with Steve Martin for one, so we oh. lost to a great book. <laughs> <All right. Yeah. laughs> well, you don't call it a loss at two. So. No. But exactly. yeah, we're working with, we're working with that, and uh, we're working with a large company uh, about a crypto coin that Izzy will be... Um, uh, Possibly launching in a few weeks. Oh, wow. Excuse me. Oh, gee, we can't even get a side hustle, and she's My got a God. crypto coin. Listen, buddy, we need to take notes from Izzy. Listen, oh. I don't know if Izzy can hear us. If we are just paupers in her eye, but but do let her know that we love her, and I'm glad oh, that she's she loves <laughs> she loves the Pix Eleven. How old is yeah, she? Loves you all. How old is she? She's four this year. She's four. Oh, she's okay. just a babe. Where are you guys located? Yeah. I don't know. Don't no. tell them. Washington, D.C. Oh, you're in D.C. Oh, you're not that say, far. I going to say, because Bella is five. Bella and Izzy should be best friends. I think Bella needs I a little friend. I actually like that. I like that. I just want to close up on Izzy's face. Idea. Yeah. Fantastic. Just well, like close up. Izzy, Rick, and Shane, thank you so much for joining us. Continued success. We will keep an eye out for more jumpers. So good to see you again. And tell Tom we said hello. Week. Yes, and yes. we called Tom Daly, we said hello. And the queen. <laughs> yes. Yeah. And the queen, the queen. That's right. right uh, thank you all for having us again. Of course. Of course. Thank you. Absolutely. Good to see you. Take, Take care. care. Good to see you. Oh, look at this. He's yawning. He's, He's done. tired. Like, I'm so tired. Fast. I'm done. He's like, 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 bye, Felicia. Bring me to my cushion. <laughs> She's like, please. <laughs>